Jay and Vijay were two guards at the gates of Vekun, a branch of heaven. They were tall, handsome figures who gleamed with diamonds, weapons, and flowers that never wilted. They were proud of their stations. We represent Lord Huddy, they thought to themselves. One day, four boys approached the gate and requested an audience with Lord Vishnu. Jay and Vijay looked at each other and scoffed. You cannot come in, they hissed. Lord Vishnu is resting. He cannot be disturbed by children, no less. Go away. Go on now. As it so happens, these were not actually boys, but wise sages destined to look young forever. The four sages were taken aback by the guards' rudeness. Are you defending the gate from a war? The sages retorted. We are only devotees looking to receive the Lord's darshan. Yet you have treated us like we are animals. You do not deserve this divine post. You belong on earth where ego and hubris abound. We hereby curse you to descend to earth far from God so you may be humbled. Lord Vishnu emerged from the gate and said, These attendants of mine, Jay and Vijay, have committed a great offense against you. They've ignored me and my teachings. I support this curse. Jay and Vijay fell to their knees before the Lord and began to weep. Please don't do this. We cannot bear to be separated from you. But the Lord remained steady. You will descend to earth for three lifetimes. But fear not. It won't be long before you're back. Your anger will be your ally. Jay and Vijay were born as demons three times. They became Hiranyaksh and Hiranyakashap, Ravan and Kumbhakarn, and Shishupal and his brother Dantabaka. In each of these lifetimes, they despise God, commit atrocities against innocent people, and ultimately, God kills them. And how it happens is so interesting. <laughs>